Hello everyone. Today I will be sharing with you some Adidas ZX Boost. These are particularly interesting. I got them from adidas.ca a few years ago. In fact, I paid around $67 for them, I think. I could be wrong. As you can see, they're blue in color, bluish purple with a floral upper. They're extremely light. Take my word for it, these sneakers are extremely light. And soon you'll see why. The ZX8000 Boost. One of the early Boost sneakers to come out. Definitely super interesting. You can see the Boost from the window at the bottom of the shoe. The grip is okay for walking, I guess. You can also see the Boost from the insole, which is completely removable, as you can see. Would you look at that? That's the whole weight of the shoe. That piece does not weigh much at all. It's incredibly light. The boost is pretty comfortable in my hand. It's a little bit squishy and firm at the same time. What I must say about them is that the sole is extremely interesting to me. Underneath, you can see the clear window from inside the shoe, which allows you to see the boost from the bottom of the shoe, as you can see. It's quite spectacular. I mean, it's not as useful as you think, but it's kind of cool. It's kind of like being able to see the inside of an expensive watch, except not as cool. Anyway, I'm going to throw this back in and I'm going to throw the sneaker on. And you'll see how they look on foot. On foot, they're okay. The silhouette is okay. My toes are sticking out, and that's the real problem. But other than that, the shoe is comfortable. The silhouette is okay. It's not too tight, but my toes, my toes do stick out. But I have to admit that there's a floral pattern on the shoe, which kind of throws me off a little bit. I think they're quite pretty, but I understand if some people would be uncomfortable wearing them. But all in all, they're good shoes. So if you like the video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Goodbye. And don't forget, I got them on sale.